This video is on options strategy. Now, there's lots of different option strategies out there, and there's lots of different reasons why you might use options. So what I'm going to do in this video is I'm going to walk through just one example, and we're going to kind of talk through it. Now, I want to be clear up front. I'm not giving any investment advice in this video. This is a purely hypothetical example. <laughs> but what my goal is, I, I want to just give you a glimpse of what's possible with financial derivatives. So let's jump into the example. Imagine you were to go out and buy some stock. And at the same time you bought that stock, you also bought options to short the stock. So what you've done is you've just created a position. And in this position, if the stock price goes up, you make money off the stock that you hold. If the stock price goes down, you make money off the options you hold. And the cool thing is, it costs you a lot less to buy the options than it did to buy the stock. Now, the important thing to understand about this is that we've reduced your risk to zero. In a mathematically perfect world, we've completely eliminated the risk in this position. Because no matter if the stock price goes up or the price goes down, you're still making money. So that's important to understand, and that's what we call hedging. Now, in the last video I made, we talked through the Black-Scholes pricing model. And this options example I'm talking about today is actually a famous example that was discussed in the paper, the academic paper written by Mr. Black and Mr. Scholes when they uh, published their Black-Scholes pricing model. Um, this was actually the starting point for how they derived their equations, was looking at this uh, option strategy. So what I want to do is I want to look a little bit closer at this example, though, because I think there's an issue here. Um, it's important whenever you're using financial derivatives to look for the catch. So let's look at this example, and we see that if the price goes up, you're making money, and if the price goes down, you're making money. So let's ask the question, what could go wrong here? What's the problem with this option strategy? Well, what if, what if the stock price stays flat? Not only that, what if the option, what if the stock price stays flat for the next 10 years and you're holding this position? Well, you wouldn't make anything. Not only that, you would lose money on the position because it costs you money to set up these financial derivatives. So the statement that um, this option strategy carries no risk is a little bit misleading. Um, finance people, what they do is they're looking at the future and they're determining what are the most likely outcomes that can happen. And to do that, they use distributions. So they'll look at a distribution and they'll look at the main part of this distribution and say, these are the most likely outcomes. And then they'll create hedging positions uh, for those outcomes. And this works really well most of the time. <laughs> but the problem arises when something happens at the tail of these distributions. And these are very unlikely events, like what we just talked about, uh, like a stock price staying flat for 10 years. That's a very unlikely outcome, but it could happen. And when events happen out on the tails of these distributions, it makes your hedging positions completely ineffective. So it's, that's why it's so important to understand what your assumptions are and understand the pitfalls of using financial derivatives. So, in walking through this example, I wanted to leave you with two main takeaways. The first one is, 
Financial derivatives can be used to hedge and greatly reduce levels of risk. The second main takeaway is this. Be careful of opportunities that claim zero risk. So I hope you enjoyed walking through this option strategy example. Um, there are lots of strategies out there. There's lots of different ways you can use options. So if you're interested, uh, there's lots of books available and I encourage you to do your own research and check that out. Um, but I hope that this video just gives you a sense of how powerful options can be.